Hi everyone, back again. I fed the hungry beast so we should be right now. Now we finished off, I had just um, embellished this uh, wallpaper pocket. So I do have a few more that I'd like to do. So we'll get on with that. Hopefully we can get it all done this time. So next I have, um, when I made these, you would have seen me use some, um, it was self-adhesive wool border. And at the end of the video, I realized that it hadn't actually stuck on. So I used my fabric glue to stick it on. And I don't know if you can see, but it sort of had a reaction and it crinkled it where the glue was. So I think when I use this again, um, I'll try it with some stick glue and see if that'll hold it down. So I have gone and embellished it somewhat um, the other day uh, with just some trims that I found. Uh, there's some sort of ladder type trim there. There's a dog fur too. I don't think I want that on there. And some brown trim just up the top. I wanted to find a fabric uh, autumn leaf, but I can't find them anywhere. I'm sure I've got some because I thought that would look really nice here. But since I don't have one, I thought I will try doing something else with that. Now I found this, which is a bit bright. It's like gauzy ribbon, but I still think it goes quite nicely in the middle there. So I'm thinking of doing some of that. And then I have some brown stuff as well, which I think will go on top and make it not so bright. Now these are going to be fun to try and stick down to. So it might be best to, I could try the stick glue. I don't know how that's going to stick on this shiny stuff, but we'll give it a go. get the lid off. I've got to wipe the tip of that because it's a bit clogged up. All right, so let's just put some down around here, I reckon. Get that down. Feels like it's sticking good, actually. some pressure see if it holds especially down the edges if it comes up what I'll do is just go around the edges with some fabric glue to make sure it holds well let's get it a bit straighter might help so I'm gonna try and put some glue on the top of that yeah, we'll get some big globs there we'll see how it goes right, just that did not work the way it was meant to. It should dry clear, I'm hoping, so we'll see. If not, I'll cry. That's not going to hold, that's for sure. So, I might do. Let's pull that off. Oh, good, we can wipe it off. Take two, learn from our mistakes. Get a bit of tissue stuck to it, so I'll just try and get that off. Alright, still quite sticky from that though. Now I'll just give this a bit of a wipe down, get the blue off of it. It's not too bad. Alright, so out the fabric glue. I'll just use this though. I'm just going to do the edges because I think there'll be a bit of cling still from the um, stick glue for it to stay down. Make sure we've got it straightish. It's not looking too bad. Got my tissue. Too bad. Now we'll do the same for the other bit of gauze that we chopped off. Just 
take a bit down. Just make sure it's coming out. There we go. Looks like this doesn't want to stay down. Possibly didn't get much glue out. I'm always learning about different glues and what holds what and which one to use. It's never ending learning. Well, we'll see how that holds. It's not too bad. Just put the little pin back in. We'll trim this off. Now, nearly all of the stuff that I'm using here, if I wasn't gifted it, m most of it comes from secondhand shop. Like all my wallpapers, all my trims, these flowers, even the buttons all came like from the secondhand shop. As I said, I was gifted a couple of wallpapers and die cuts and that, but yeah, so it's really good to be able to use all the stuff that I've been grabbing on all my secondhand hauls. Yeah, I do like that flower, I like just like that, I reckon. Mm. And then I'm thinking of putting a button in the middle again. That way. That way's quite nice, I might do that. So I'll stick the flower together first. Yeah, like I was saying, my dog has leukemia and she takes prednisolone um, just to keep her going and... Um, stops inflammation and stuff uh, but that has the side effect of making her extremely hungry and uh, wee all the time so it's a bit of work looking after her but I love her so you do these things she's my best little buddy I love that flower Bit of glue on the bottom. Get a nice blob on there. Now pick it up so I can try and center it. It's not too bad. Just apply a bit of pressure. I think that'll do for that one. Quite like that now. Put that to the side. And then I have these two pretty rose ones. I'll grab this one first. I love this wallpaper. It's another one that Susan gave, Susanna gave me. So I've got some ribbon that goes with the roses really nicely. I'm going to chop two bits of this off, I reckon. Might end up using two bits of it. And some of this lace, you see this lace all the time because I do have so much, I just keep using it. And I like it because it's already a bit discoloured and that, so it's sort of vintage looking. Cut two bits of that because I think we're going to use it for the next one we make as well. That is gonna. I don't know if I cut it a bit short. No, I might just do. Alright, get my little glue. Stick the ribbon on. I think I've got to fill this up again soon. There we go.
you uncenter the ribbon. It's looking all right. bottom here it's a bit like the um, previous one that we've done I'll probably do the next one a bit like this this as well but I really do like the way the ribbon and this lace look and I love the roses so much I don't want to cover them up trim that if I can find my little scissors Sticky, so everything's sticking to everything. There we go. Now, I also think I like having a bit of ribbon. Yeah, I do like some ribbon up the top. I'm just going to see if I've got anything thicker that would match, but I don't think it's almost a nice colour to go with. It's not the same colour though, so. something that thick. It is nice with it but let's have a look if I pick it up. I do kind of like it. Do I like it more than this? Probably not. It's close though. So I will stick this down. sticking to me as well good to know I'm so attractive everything wants to stick to me I know lame jokes straight and then a little bit of glue just under here that one kind of like it just like that I reckon I do have more flowers than that that could go on it I'm not sure if I want to put them on so a quick look and see so I've got all of these ones I've got these which are quite a nice color I don't really think it needs it no I reckon it needs it. So leave that one like that. And then the last one we have is this one. So another really pretty one. So I did find some ribbon that I think will go nicely with that as well. Which can go under this lace again. Just works so well. And as I said, I'm sort of trying to use that lace up. I've got so much of it. So we'll do that. Cut two bits in case we want to do it how we did the previous one. Got so many things to put away. Uh, yeah, it's got to get it better organized. It's just I thought, well, I might want this and I might want that, and yeah. Now, what am I doing? I'll do this first. Put it on that way. Yeah, 
I should go back to um, filming in my craft room and then everything's in there ready to go but it is a bit pokey to get the tripod in so once I in the future I'm going to have to invest I think in um, a phone camera and one of those overhead uh, camera mounts and then I'll be able to set it up at my desk in there Greatest. I think she'll do. Yeah, that's pretty. I'll put the pin in here. I can get it. Just make sure that hasn't dried up. It's a bit crooked there, but that's all right. If I don't tell you, you wouldn't know, maybe. Then I'd get away with it. Got a big mouth. Sweet, isn't it? That one. Let's see whether I want ribbon up the top. Actually, don't. Don't know if I need it on this one. I feel like it. Yeah, I like it like that. Actually, Just thinking, what else have I got? Don't know if any of those buttons would suit. Now my flowers, none of them are really the right colour. More pinks, it's not too bad. It's not really good either. So I don't think any of that would really suit either. Just thinking if I've got anything else that would go. I've got some scraps of lace and stuff. I don't know whether we could put some more of that or a little cluster or something. Just seeing what I've got in here. It's almost nice. I've got some of that which would go quite nicely. I'm not sure exactly what I would put on it. It's a bit more of a pink I think. That one. What else do we have around here? Got all my laces here. I've got some apricot looking lace. Some of that might be good. Could do a little cluster. Now, I do have, I thought I bought out a little bit of blend. Guy. I've got these little, I don't want the roses, they're quite nice though, but those pearl bling might go good on the cluster thing. Okay, let's see what we can do here. Let's cut a bit of this one off. Let's have a look which lace we like the best. Probably this one, cut a bit of that off. Too big. And I had this, which was huge.
down a bit. Why not cut a bit of this off as well? Now, then we had this if we feel like using it, which we might not. See how this can go together. Just whack it on. I know that's a bit too much almost. I think we need to make this bit even smaller. fingers now. Now what is this stuff like? No, I don't like that. Can't get it off my fingers now either. Now, let's just grab this little scrappy bit here. Just cut that down a bit. That's quite nice, sort of. Now, where do I put that peachy one? I think that's a bit big. A bit heavy up the top. That's a bit better, I reckon. Alright, getting somewhere. Now, let's get in that. I'll do it something like that. I'm going to cut this down even a little bit more. To be a bit messier, doesn't it? Sort of. All right, let's just stick it together. I could think about it forever. That wouldn't get me very far, so I'll just stick it together. Now, do we want some of that bling somewhere? I can open it. Don't know if it will go well on. Mm, it's quite nice on there. Just whether I want more than one or not. over that side. I don't know what I mean. It'd look like eyes if I put two on, I reckon, which would look funny. Put it at the top, down the bottom. I kind of like it in the middle, so I will do that. dollop of glue in there. Let's 
see if I've got my scrap paper here too. Let's see if I've got any scrap music paper because I think that would actually go quite nice underneath. I think I've spot some. that all right we'll get the ink onto that got to do vintage photo maybe brush oh, I haven't even used that yet a vintage photo I might try this brush pour dry see what it's like So I hope everyone's crafting away. It's a good night for it here. It's getting cold. Put the heater on afterwards and make a cuppa. Watch some videos on YouTube. That's quite a nice colour that is actually. I might just break this little bit off a bit. It's quite nicely like that. So let's stick this down first. around the edges I reckon it all in a bit. Oh, that's not too bad. Alright. So, that's the first thing I like to make with my wallpaper is pockets. So there are all the pockets that we've done so far. And I shall be back in a day or two with the next thing that I like to make with my wallpaper. Hope you've enjoyed them and it gives you some ideas. As I said they're very simple but the wallpaper is so pretty they just don't need much embellishment. So yeah. Anyway everyone have a good evening, morning, whatever it is where you are. And I will see you very soon. Bye. <laughs>